It was hump day at the SWC midweek hockey as the Bees took on the Merritt Centennials and Matthew Biotti early on. Chance to open up the scoring, but ranging off the pipe past Andrew Ballantyne. The Bees do get on the board, though, 220 in. Ryan McPherson from brother Connor. Nice setup here. Connor wins the race to the puck in the corner. Great backhand sauce across. And Ryan, nice backhand deke. Five full pass. Ballantyne look from behind the net. Ryan's 11th of the year. First of two points of the night. Nice little deke in tight. The Philadelphia Flyers prospect makes it one nothing just over two minutes in. But that was the only goal in the first period. Andrew Ness made this start. He was looking for his sixth win, and he was sharp again. There's a change up from the blue line that he smothers for the whistle. Andrew Ballantyne as well. No slouch in the Merritt Centennials net. Stopped 27 of 29. One of the better chances here. Luke Melnick in the first period. Great back check by Meyer and Stevenson to negate that partial breakaway. That kept it one nothing. Pinticked and Bees tried to add to lead backer in front to Zach Stringer, but just couldn't get the handle on that puck. Elsewhere, Michael Felsing partial breakaway, probably the best stop of the night for Andrew Ness. Look at that diving right pad save. Great look from behind the net. Felsing, one of the top players in the BCHL this season. So we go to the second period. Bees on the power play, trying to add to their one nothing lead. Ballantyne makes the stop on Fisher, then Ryan McPherson falling diving chance, couldn't score, and Fisher in the rebound stop. At the side of the net as well. Bees looking for more. Kate Littler off the rush. Stopped by Ballantyne, but would get a measure of revenge a few minutes later as Littler scores his first as a V at 942. Look at that play. Just goes around the zone, left to right wing. Gets around everyone in red, then roofs it short side over the goaltender. Pops the water bottle off. His first from Ryan and Connor McPherson at 942. The Calgary Flames prospect made it 2-0 Pintic, and that was a big goal. Bees are looking for some more in the third period on the power play, but nice stop there by Ballantyne as he stops Biotti down low. Penticton in the third, up 2-0, trying to add to that lead, but couldn't do so, and that was big because Merritt, they came back and scored on the power play. They finally crack Andrew Ness. Jackson Murray scores his ninth. Nice shot at 544 from the right circle. Goes over the stick side. No chance for Ness as his shutout streak ends there. But the V's almost right away responding on the ensuing faceoff. But a big stop by Ballantyne. Doesn't matter. V's hang on for 2-1 win. Highlights brought to you by the Penticton Herald. The V's still perfect at home. And the home win streak now at 53 and counting.